Hi everyone and welcome to my YouTube channel. So I'm starting day three off with breakfast. Breakfast is kind of the same with a few items that are changed every day. So today we just decided to explore the local market. We were really exhausted from yesterday's trip. So just decided to have a chilled out day today. Because my mum speaks Arabic, we're going to travel like the locals. And this is a minibus and it's pretty cheap compared to the taxis. You can travel in less than a pound, whereas if you took a taxi, it would be way more. All the windows were open, so there was a lot of fresh air coming in. It was a really comfortable ride and the locals were really friendly. So we just reached the market and this is the most famous local market. So this market is known as the Sukul Kudra and in English it's just known as the vegetable market. So I just asked my mum how much the fare ride was and it was 15 pence each. So if you want to save money definitely take the minibus. Honestly, this was the most peaceful market experience I've ever had. The shopkeepers were not hounding me to come in and buy stuff. And also nobody looked at you as if you were a foreigner. I just found the whole experience really pleasant and it was really comfortable walking around without a machine. The locals were really kind. If you needed any kind of help, they would stop and help you. The weather was great, so it was a really nice feeling walking around. It was really nice exploring the market and looking at the clothes, food and other things that they sold. We did stop in a few shops to take some things for back home as gifts. I was really thirsty at this point so I stopped for some fresh sugar cane juice. There was a bit of a queue so I had to wait for my turn. I really couldn't wait to try this. And can you believe this is fresh pistachio? I've never seen this in my life. So after grabbing my juice, we kept walking and came across this beautiful mosque. There were a lot of tourists outside. This was the Al Husseini Grand Mosque. It looked beautiful from the outside and in the inside as well. I thought I'll try the juice while I was walking around. It was really nice and sweet and I hadn't had sugar cane juice in a long, long time. It was really nice not to be hounded by shopkeepers. I entered this really pretty shop. Um, it sold souvenirs and other things and I did buy myself a couple of things. After shopping, we were really, really hungry, so we stopped by this restaurant. All this food was for two people. Their portions are huge, so I would advise only ordering for one person. 
and then you can share it between two people. The food was absolutely delicious. I love the salad and the grape wine leaves wrapped in rice. I really enjoyed lunch a lot. So after a few hours of rest in a hotel room, we came back outside just to have a bit of a walk and to grab some dinner as well. The weather was really pleasant, but it was a bit cooler than during the day, so it was good to grab a jacket. So apparently this restaurant was supposed to be really famous with the locals. It's called the Mawal restaurant and it's right next to my hotel. We were going to try this on some other day because we had quite a few days left of our trip. We were headed towards KFC which was really close by to our hotel. It was just on the other side. I will be sharing my photos from the market on my Instagram page. So do give me a follow, it's Miss Enchanted Rain. The walk was really needed and it was nice to pass by some shops along the way. I did grab some fruit from here to take back to the hotel. The KFC here looks really fancy compared to the ones we get back at home. And this is what I got. I got the spicy prawn with a bun, some chips and some coleslaw salad. It is really unusual to see prawns in KFC, but I've seen it in Egypt too. We had some time to kill, so we decided to go for a walk further down and we know that there's a mall further down, so we're gonna go check that out now. We did pass by some really pretty homeware shops and it was really nice to look into. It's really safe to walk in Amman even in the late evenings. And here it is, the Galaria Mall. It was really handy having a mall really close by to our hotel. We had a quick look around in the shops. There was even a crafts fair happening inside. I love Tony Molly. I decided not to get any more makeup only because I've got so much at home that I need to finish. We decided to stop for some ice cream at this place. They had a good selection of breads, pastries, sandwiches, salads and pizzas. And cookies, cake and ice cream. We're just here for the ice cream because we already ate. The ice cream looks so good here, so I decided to choose the strawberry ice cream. This one looked the best, I wasn't too sure about the other flavours so I just decided to stick with strawberry.
Honestly, this was the best strawberry ice cream I've ever had. So that was it for today and if you've enjoyed watching, please do like, share and subscribe and I will catch you on the next vlog. Thank you. You're like a circle that floats around.